hit, and it was like I, I just seen fire, like a big, like fire, like orange, a big ball, and then it was just that loud, it was a big fireball, and well, it was just an, like an explosion, like an orange fireball. Well, breaking tonight, a man killed when his car was hit by an Amtrak train on Navco Road at Dog River Drive. The mangled and burned wreckage scattered, some of it even sticking to the front of the train. Witnesses telling Fox and News the driver drove around the crossing arms trying to beat the train. Our Ariel Mallory is live at the scene. And Ariel, you talked to some of the victim's family members. Yeah, we did, Lanise and Byron, and as you can imagine, it's been a very emotional night tonight. And just within the last hour, Mobile Police have identified the driver killed. It was 28-year-old Chadwick Timmons. And behind me, you can actually see where they just pulled the train from behind, from where it was, a couple of yards down from where that crash happened. I'm going to get my photographer to zoom in, and you can just slightly see some of that charred burn from when that impact happened. And we do have pictures to also show you just how strong that impact was. Was, you can still see what appears to be the front bumper of the car attached to the train badly burned. According to Mobile Fire Rescue, the crash happened just before 7 o'clock at the intersection of Navco Road and Dog River Drive. Now, witnesses tell us they saw the driver going around the crossing arms trying to beat the train when he was struck, causing the car to burst into flames. We did speak with a woman who saw it all. Saw the arms down to the train track. I saw the Amtrak train. I heard the whistle, heard the whistle coming so loud. Um, and it was probably because the car, I guess I heard the whistle so loud, um, because the car was trying to cross and he was like in between the rails. The rails were down and um, the train hit the car. Now, it is still a pretty heavy police presence out here tonight, as well as CSX workers working on that train. But as far as traffic on NAVCO, it is back open. Live right now in Mobile, Ariel Mallory, Fox 10 News.